What's up everybody? It's July 25th, 2022 in Big Bear Lake, California, and we are getting some rain and it looks like a pretty massive storm coming through. It doesn't look too too big in terms of how long it's gonna last, but it looks like we're driving into something pretty special. So hopefully, hopefully, it looks like it's been raining pretty good over here. We were just in the, I was just in the village eating lunch and I could see all of this happening on this side of town, so. I wouldn't be surprised if we get a little hail out of it. I mean, the storm, the cloud looked black. It's totally black over here, so we'll see. How are you guys doing today? Hello, everybody. It's good to see you guys. Guys are talking to a married man now by the way <laughs> very married very happy very happy I've, I've never been this happy in my entire life so thank you guys for all the support you guys will get to meet my lovely bride someday soon she is a very busy woman and look at look what's going on here look what's going on here I told you we could get a little bit of hail coming out of this so when we turn right at Sugarloaf to cut through town to get all the way to the other side because that's the only reason we take sugar loop. Oh my gosh, look at this guys. We should be heading into a heavier part of this storm. So we shall see. Okay. Yeah, it's getting heavier out there, you can tell. My car needed a wash too. It's 68 degrees. It was just about 85 degrees, but when we got this rain starting to come down, the temperature dropped significantly. So we're at 67. It's 1.15 p.m. on July 25th, Monday, July 25th, 2022, in Big Bear Lake and Big Bear City. Or just in Big Bear. I'm telling you guys, keep your eyes peeled. Or, yeah, keep your eyes open because there's probably going to be some lightning straight ahead. Wow, it's flooding. Wow, oh, cool. We need this so bad. We need this type of heavy rain like this. All right, guys, so I think I'm going to shut it off and do a continuation video in just, just a moment. This is freaking awesome. All right, guys, give me a second. I will be right back. Hang on. It keeps getting heavier, though. Just hang on. Okay, you know what? Let's see here. All right. Okay, you guys, I turned it on right down the street. So look at it, just in that past five minutes that it hasn't been on, I haven't seen flooding like this, this whole season. So this is freaking awesome. I just heard a huge clasp of thunder. Oh my gosh, I love this, I love it. My windshield wipers are going as fast as they can. It's not even doing anything. Sorry guys, I'm not trying to screw everything up, make the video look like crap. Crapola, crapola. Here. Okay, so as I said, when you go up here, you want to go to Sugarloaf Boulevard because it, it helps you cut through this side of Big Bear City. I've showed you guys the detour before, but we're heading back here because it looks like the storm kind of ends a little past here. So we're just going to stay under the brunt of this storm right now. And this is just incredible. Like, incredible. Hang on, let me. Wow, guys. Look at this river right here. Oh my gosh! Did you guys hear that? Whoa, look at this! Holy moly! 
This is insane. This is insane. Okay, guys, we're back on. So we're gonna head over to Big Bear Lake. I think this storm's pushing that way. But this storm has dumped the most rain. I mean, look at all this water running off. Look at it everywhere. It's great. I mean, everywhere. And this is just rushing, rushing to the lake. You guys would be surprised. It doesn't take too many of these thunderstorms to eventually fill up the lake, believe it or not. But let's, let's listen for thunder. It is so loud because it's right on top of us. This is awesome though, super awesome. the turtle but that's okay it's raining so <laughs> when these storms are moving so fast and the car in front of me is going slower than the storm is probably moving it I hate that but at the same time I don't want people to be unsafe sometimes as you guys know I do get a little bit irritated but I've been doing a lot better over the years you guys know that and I don't want anyone to have an accident because I want to go fast so oh, wow just puddles everywhere There's gonna be some big lightning right there, I'm sure. Inside the car now. It's so pretty. This is what we like up here, these type of monsoonal storms. Alright, you know what? I have to stop at Stater Brothers anyway, so we're gonna go to Staters real quick. If it's 
still pumping like this when we leave, we'll keep recording, okay? But look at this, you can hardly see the road. Wow. Wow, look at all this. This is awesome. Come on, come on, come on, people now. Smile not on your brother. Everybody can get Try and stay dry and alive now. Hang on. Okay, so we are heading to Moonridge now. I figured we might get a little good rain up there right now, so we're going to head up there. We are going to head up there. Look at its blue skies over Snow Summit, but then right over here, it's dark. We're looking forward to this. Wow, look, it's so blue over in most of Big Bear Lake area. So I'm expecting all of this to come through this area because that's the typical monsoon flow from the desert this way. The opposite of when our storms in the wintertime come through, or how they come through. They usually come like north, northwest, come diving down the coast. These are coming from the okay. south. My phone just overheated, which is kind of weird. dark right there. I'm telling you guys. Alright, so we need to head up. Oops, hang on. My stupid thing. Sorry guys. Alright, That's okay. So main part of Moonridge right there is shut down because they're doing a lot of uh, they're doing a lot of work. They have some new stuff going in there. I think they're putting a roundabout and some other stuff in there just to make things harder in the wintertime. I just can't, I, I, I think the roundabout's a great idea, but in the wintertime up here, with all the people who don't know how to drive on s snow and ice, I think doing circles is probably not the best thing, but hey, call me crazy. But yeah, so that's the main moon ridge right there. I'll roll down my window so you guys can see any little spot we get past here. guys good to see you and uh hopefully a lot more of this to come
Peace. Oh, July 25th, 2022. Big Bear Lake. Okay, so I want you guys to see we're in Upper Moon Ridge right now. There's Bear Mountain right there, but you can see the blue skies over here, but to the right, it's just nasty. There's, they didn't get any rain up here. It's insane. It's like just barely, oh my gosh, I'm, I'm really shocked that they didn't even get any drizzle up here. Hang on. Kind of like the middle parts of Moon Ridge. We're looking over here to the left at Bear Mountain. Once we get across here, we're on a road called Sheephorn right now. But it's crazy. Up in Upper Moon Ridge, guys, there was nothing. Not one drop of any rain. Nothing. Nothing. It's beautiful, though, guys. What a gorgeous day we got here. What a gorgeous day. I just want you guys to see what the sky is looking like. We're driving towards the weather right now, but I think the brunt of it is out of the Big Bear area now, unfortunately. But it said we could get some scattered thunderstorms today, so I'm hoping we get some more. It's it's that time of the day when the storms will really start blowing up as well, the, the hottest part of the day. So hopefully that happens. Hopefully that happens. Yeah, you can see it's just blue over there, and then over here it's just storm. I wouldn't be surprised if we see a lightning bolt straight ahead, though. That would be kind of cool. Anyway, you know what? I'm just going to... Wow, look at that view. That is so pretty. You guys, seriously, this is so pretty. Big Bear is such a wonderful place. To regarding the uh, topography and everything in there all the nature stuff all right anyway we're, we're done with this for right now we're gonna head back to this side of town because this is where i need to go i love you guys i think this is gonna be it for the video i truly believe <laughs> i don't want to go though because i miss you guys so much but anyway love you guys and i will see you guys soon and yeah bye till next time Till next time. <laughs>